Hi guys, I'm back. I was weirdly chopped off there. Eh? And I don't like that, so... <clears throat> I came back to give you another half hour of my company. So let's get into this so that <clears throat> I can get this pile put away and get some more new stuff out for us to look at. Okay, this is a... Um, I'm not really sure. Might be clay. But it's kind of pretty, pretty late 80s looking. Barrel clasp of the plastic type, plastic rounded type. But that's, you know, that's what it is. <clears throat> oh, this is cute. Let me see if we can get it out of the tangles. Now this is, hmm, I believe this might be dyed, maybe dyed quartz. Let me know if you know any different. I'm always up to learn something new. I tell my son I know everything, but that's not really true. These are glass. These are all glass. Some little seed beads. Very cute. Nice little toggle clasp. Handmade, I think, but beautiful job. <clears throat> Long string of round beads, which are kind of silver and white. Kind of graduated on the same on the same bead. Different. Makes them kind of look a little bit like they're real stones, but they're not. They're plastic. Toggle clasp. Another homemade job. Very nice. Oh, here's a pair of earrings for us. Not sure if we've seen these ones before. Another pair. I think this clasp is Monet. And yes, it does say Monet on there. So these are these are in great condition. Quite big. At least an inch long, maybe just over an inch. Not my type of thing, but you know. We're all different, different strokes. Okay. I think this is I think this might go with the um the necklace that we saw in the last video. It's purple, but this light is a little different now because it's later in the day and I'm losing my natural light. So I think that's the bracelet stretch. It's a jumbo. Big sword glass. This is a little tangle. Let's see if we can get it undone. So I hope everybody's day has gone well. I hope that if there's stress going on in your day, that you can take a moment by yourself to reflect and calm down and realize that at the end of the day there's really no sense in being stressed out about too much. Because happier, happier times are always come back around. Okay. This beastie is... Oh, there we go. <coughs> now this is... These are heavy. And they do not feel like glass. I'm not sure if they're real dyed pearls. Kind of like a bluey, reddy, 
dark grey, iridescent, has a really nice clasp which has a little bit of wear, vintage clasp. Let's see if we can see anything on it. No. Oh. But it's hard to tell with pearls. I mean, some pearls are real. I mean, some pearls are just, you know, freshwater pearls. Or So, you know, I have to say I do prefer freshwater pearls to real pearls because they have a little more character, a little more difference in them, different shapes, different colour. Earring. Well, we've got two earrings here side by side. They are post earrings for PSDs. Looks like a stone in there, but I'm not sure if it's just glass. <coughs> Kayam family, it says on there. I think that is Leah Sophia, if I'm right. I think her name is Leah Sophia Kayam. So they're, they're quite cute. Kind of like a fat teardrop shape. Oh, well, here's a watch. I do not like watches very much. I do love vintage ladies' watches. Tiny, tiny watches I love. 14, hang on. 14, 40? 14.40 sports. And it's going, needs to be set. That's good. This is a fine little necklace in very good condition. With a nice extender for those of us ladies who are more amply built. Okay, I'll give up on that. Here's some lovely crystal beads, iridescent. And it's kind of a little bit like liquid silver, but it's more shiny. Nice, nice and delicate. What is this? Oh, this is one of those watches. A little ladybug. <laughs> I haven't seen one of these in years. I don't think it has a brand. Stainless steel. Case back. Japan movement. And some numbers. And that is on a chain. Which is attached to an anchor. Underneath the sea of jewellery. There we go, we got it free. <laughs> okay, what's this? Oh, this is a seed. Big old seed. That's nice though. And there's some seed beads as well. But it doesn't have a clasp, so I can't undo it to get it out. Oh, we might have some success here. Let's see. Yes, we got it out. Yay. That's nice. It's not something I would wear. Maybe when I was a lot younger and a lot thinner and could wear a beautiful sundress on the beach. That would be, that would suit very well. Very nice. Plastic. Looks like glass, but it's plastic. Nice and long. These cute little green beads. Has a tag which says the 
VJ. VJ. Veronica Jones. No, just keep them. I don't know who that is. Here's another one of those knotty type ones that we saw before. And it is missing a clasp. This is nice colours, beautiful beads, some shell, some dyed shell, very nice, and that actually looks big enough to fit me. That is nice, needs a clean though, needs a bath and some dawn. Money clip, men's money clip, no writing, no mark, I think it's stainless. Oh, this is nice. It's got a nice big crystal down here, glass crystal. It's got some chains and some plastic rhinestones and some beautiful glass beads here, brown and darker brown. Yeah, that's nice. No tag. I see shells. This is a nice little homemade shell necklace with some plastic yeah, plastic beads a little pearl a lovely shell from the ocean lovely anything natural and given to us by mother earth I respect and love and love to wear it gives me good vibes This is stunning. Camera's not picking it up as well as I can see it, but it's very, very brilliant and shiny. Some clear rhinestones, some kind of pinky brown, some aurora borealis right there in the middle. Yeah few different colours going on there, but they're lovely. Nice necklace for a nice night. Night out on the town, dinner, or going to the club, or... Even just if you want to get dressed up and go for a walk in the park. Who's to say? Very nice. Like that one. What else we got here? Nice bangle. Not sure if we've seen one of these before because I quite often get repeat items in these buckets. Plastic, metal, cuff bracelet. Another beautiful stone necklace. Looks pretty similar to the one we've had before, I think. Not sure if it's the same colour. Lovely. Hope you guys can hear that. And these these warm up brilliantly against your skin. And I just love to feel that. Bearing. Got some bracelets here. This is a enamel. Quite large bracelet, and it fits me. Cuff bracelet. Oh, we have something inside, and that says stainless steel steel chisel, China. I'll have to look that one up. I haven't heard of chisel. Okay, here's a cute little bracelet. 
warm. Not too warm. Nice little closure. I like these types of bracelets, especially if they have, um, did we see that? Oh, there's two. Very thin metal. That's really pretty. It's like a cherry blossom. <clears throat> and this is multi chain. Come on, untangle for me. Oh, I think that goes with that. We've got a little tangle here, but I think this is multi-chain. And it, it's very different. I'm not sure if somebody's made this or if it's manufactured. 